In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how to identify aldehydes and ketones. So we have four separate molecules here. Focusing in on A, you'll notice that we have this carbon right here, double bonded to this oxygen. We'll use that as our focus. Now all aldehydes have this structure. They have a carbon double bonded to an oxygen. Then you have the rest of the molecule represented by R, and this carbon is bonded to a hydrogen. As you can see, this molecule has that configuration, so this is an aldehyde. Look at this one in comparison. We have carbon double bonded to oxygen once again, right here, except to the right of this carbon is another carbon molecule. That is a carbon with three hydrogens. So this is a ketone as opposed to an aldehyde. Ketones have this structure. The rest of the molecule, and make sure that the rest of the molecule starts with a carbon carbon double bonded to oxygen, and this carbon is bonded to another carbon. Looking at this one, it has the same configuration as what we saw in A. We have carbon double bonded to oxygen and a hydrogen with the rest of the molecule. So this is an aldehyde. I'll write down K for ketone here. Over here we have a carbon double bonded to oxygen and it's single bonded to two other carbon molecules. So that is a ketone. And there you have it. That's how to identify aldehydes and ketones.